Hello, and welcome to CES Toronto Language Spot. Today we're going to be looking at the suffix ish. Now, a suffix is a letter or group of letters added at the end of a word which makes a new word or changes the meaning of the original word. We use ish to talk about something approximately or something being around a certain amount or description. So, for example, we can use ish to talk about a time. Imagine you're making plans to meet a friend and you decide to meet at five-ish. That could be before five, just before five, or just after five. It's not an exact time. You could plan to meet for dinner at seven-ish. Next, we can use some adjectives. So here I've used near-ish, smallish, and tallish. So imagine someone is asking you um, if you know a place to get their phone fixed. And you know a place, but you don't know exactly what the address is. So you can tell them that the store is nearish to downtown or maybe nearish uh, to the grocery store, and they can have a sort of approximate idea of where the store is. Next, we can use ish to describe someone's height. So someone could be smallish or they could be tallish. You don't know exactly how tall they are, but you know they're either like in the taller range or in the smaller range. Last, we can use ish to describe someone's age. So if somebody asks you uh, how old your uncle is, you could say he's 50-ish, maybe just before 50, just after 50. Or if they ask how old your uh, cousin is, she could be 20-ish or 25-ish, around that age. Keep in mind that we can use different adjectives here, or different numbers, or even different times. Just depends when your plan is, or what you're describing, or what age you're describing. I hope you've enjoyed the video, and I hope to see you soon.